हेलो एंड नमस्ते माय नेम इज मिस्टर गौतम बेहरा एंड टुडे आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग ऑन सॉल्वेंट एक्सट्रैक्शन मेथडोलॉजी सो व्हाट आर द स्टेप्स वी नीड टू फॉलो ड्यूरिंग सॉल्वेंट एक्सट्रैक्शन बेसिकली सॉल्वेंट एक्सट्रैक्शन इज अ पार्टीशनिंग प्रोसेस वेयर द सॉल्यूट गेट पार्टीशन इनटू टू डिफरेंट इमिसिबल लिक्विड वन इज ऑर्गेनिक एंड वन इज एक्वस सो व्हाट इज द प्रोसीजर ऑफ सॉल्वेंट एक्सट्रैक्शन the first pro- first step in the solvent extraction is the dissolution stage where we dissolve our ore into an suitable leaching solution our leaching solution is our aqueous solution so during leaching what happens if two or more metallic values are of similar chemical behavior they get soluble into this leaching solution so the so at the end of this leaching process we'll get a leach liquor containing two or more metallic values soluble metallic values the next step is the extraction and decontamination here we take the leach liquor and we add the organic phase or the organic solvent to this aqueous phase and we do mixing or we do agitation so during this process a particular metallic values will get soluble into the organic phase leaving behind other metallic values in the aqueous phase so here you can see x plus and y plus both are the metallic values present in the aqueous phase but when the organic phase is added and it is mixed it is agitated the x is moving into the organic phase leaving y in the aqueous phase now the third stage is the partitioning stage so we know that this organic phase is lighter or less denser as compared to that of the aqueous phase so it always floats so the partitioning means we just have to separate the loaded organic phase from the unloaded aqueous phase next the fourth stage is the stripping stage where we bring a fresh aqueous solution and we add this fresh aqueous solution to the loaded organic phase so here and we do mixing so here what happens just opposite to the second stage occurs the metallic values which is present in the organic phase will migrates to the aqueous phase then we can do partitioning simply then last one is the auxiliary process where we recirculate this organic phase again to the step number 2 because this organic phase or organic solvents are very expensive we cannot discard it like that then we'll discuss a case study where we can separate zirconium from hypenium if both are present in the aqueous solution or that is present in the leach liquor so here to separate zirconium and hypenium suppose we choose a organic phase that is tributyl phosphate kerosene and this tributyl phosphate kerosene is added to a leach liquor containing zirconium and hypenium and we do agitation or stirring so what happens the zirconium have high solubility into this organic phase so it will migrates into this organic phase leaving behind hypenium then in another case if we choose ammonium thiocyanate in diethyl ether as a organic phase and we add it to the aqueous phase containing zirconium and hypenium here hypenium have high solubility as compared to that of zirconium into this organic phase so zirconium will migrates into this organic phase leaving behind sorry hypenium will migrates into this organic phase leaving behind zirconium so selectivity of organic phase is very essential to do solvent extraction next we'll discuss an important part that is the extraction coefficient so solvent extraction is nothing but a mass transfer process where the solute is transferred across the interface of the organic and aqueous phase so extraction coefficient is ci organic by ci aqueous where o is the organic phase a is the aqueous phase so-